Hey, hello, I'm sitting here with a bowl full of tortilla chips and a crock pot full of hot cheddar cheese and spinach party dip. Uh, this just came out of the oven a while ago and it's actually, look at this, just a uh, melted deliciousness. There's cream cheese and cheddar cheese in there. There's lots of spinach. There's only a few ingredients that's so really easy to make. You just mix them together and then pop it in the oven and that is that. So let's go in the kitchen and make some of this. Mm -mm. Right now. All right, to make our hot cheddar cheese and spinach party dip, well, there's only a few ingredients we need. Um, we've got here is the cream cheese. Now that's 340 grams or 12 ounces of cream cheese. It's set out at room temperature a little bit so it's softer, so we can easily cream it. Uh, here I've got uh, 10 ounces or 300 grams of cheddar cheese grated. I've got a third of a cup of mayonnaise. That just kind of gives it a little bit of flow to the whole mix. And then here we've got a teaspoon each of salt and pepper and then the spinach. This is two 7 ounce or 200 gram uh, frozen packages of spinach which has been uh, thawed out and drained. Now if you get different sizes, if you're... Uh, I don't know what you're getting in your country, different uh, amounts. It's not that critical. If it's a little bit more spinach, a little less spinach, really not going to make any difference to the overall dip. So let's get this all together. First thing, I'm going to take a larger bowl and I'm going to put the cream cheese in here. And then I'm just going to cream up that cream cheese a little bit. Oh, it's pretty soft and creamy already. That's good. All right. And then what I want to do is I want to cream in the salt and pepper. Get those mixed into there a bit. That's looking good. Just kind of cream it around a little bit. Then we'll cream in the mayonnaise. All right, now get that just creamed in. See how that's going to just make things more flowy. <laughs> right. So get that mixed in there. Okay, just doesn't have to be perfect, just basically mixed in to this point because now we're going to also mix in is the cheddar cheese. Let's get that in there. Cheddar cheese. Kind of mix that in a little bit. All right, just kind of cutting through that a bit. Let's get that spinach in there. You see, it's pretty easy, right? Just a quick mix of a bunch of different ingredients. Not that many ingredients even, so this is rather an easy dip to make. You can whip this up real quickly. Got people suddenly coming over. Got like a party, football game, whatever. And you need some dip. Well, here you go. You just mix this together and then we're gonna toss it all in the oven. The oven's gonna do all the rest of the work. All right, that's about it. It doesn't have to be perfectly mixed. Just kind of get it distributed. Now, mm, yeah. Now, there's a couple different things you can use to uh, bake this in. Now, if you have a really nice oven-proof bowl that you can put it in, fantastic. Just put it in the oven like that and serve it like that. I don't happen to have a nice larger oven-proof bowl, so I'm just going to use this baking dish and then just transfer it to something that looks a little nicer. That's okay, too. So just dump this all into here. Okay, got... Uh, everything out of there. Let's put that out to one side. Make sure I get all this goodness in here. And then I'm just going to mm -hmm, spread that out a little bit. Now I've got the oven over there heating up at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius. I'm going to put this in there for about 20 minutes. I want to see everything melting. I want to see the cheese bubbling a little on top, a little bit of browning happening, and then 
we're going to be ready for enjoying our party dip. So, I'm going to put that in the oven, and I'll see you in about 20 minutes. All right, that's been in the oven now for 20 minutes. It's melted. We got a little, just a little browning starting to happen on there. It is absolutely perfect. So, let's get a chip. <laughs> let's get a chip and uh, dip one in there. Oh, look at that. Huh? Isn't that beautiful? That is fantastic. It's going to be a little hot right now, but that is an absolutely fantastic dip for chips, vegetables, whatever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, what I like to do here is serve this up in something that looks a little more festive than a baking dish. So I've got this big deep dish pot here, but this is not oven proof, so I can't really throw it in the oven. So I'm going to take this and just and see we can also mix it together a little bit all right a little mix together oh yeah fantastic look at that deliciousness just gonna spoon that straight into there and there we go a nice pot full of hot cheddar cheese and spinach party dip let's just have another one of those shall we look at that that's just absolutely fantastic load it up on there mmm mm -hmm. I enjoy that now if you go to the link up here on the screen and also clickable in this video's description you can download and print out this recipe from the snack and appetizer recipes booklet on Kuma's Kitchen's Patreon page just click the featured tag called recipes now Go print out the recipe and enjoy hot cheddar cheese and spinach party dip. And make cooking fun again with Kuma's Kitchen. Yeah.